Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Thank you for coming. We're here for an important reason, something that we're very proud of. This is um, kind of the culmination of something that we uh, talked about when we first came into office and when um, I hired Tracy and, and we talked about goals for the, for the department and ways that we could um, serve uh, seniors. Um, and so I'm here today with uh, Tracy Mason, who's our uh, administrator for the Department of Senior and Adult Services, as well as um, Sandy Babick. She's a clinical manager with the Western Reserve uh, Area Office on Aging. And we're talking about a new initiative that we think is going to um, help us in our, in our mission and our work to um, serve uh, seniors and adults with disabilities here in Cuyahoga County. Uh, it's very important to us that after seniors have uh, led a lifetime of uh, hard work that they will know that um, we're here for them and that there are resources that they can uh, access uh, that will allow them to uh, live out their retirement with uh, dignity and uh, respect. The senior population is about one in eight Americans so it's a big part of what we do and who we serve and everybody has personal experiences uh, with that, including my own family. My mother just turned 86 on Christmas Day, uh, and she's doing great. But every once in a while, people need a little bit of help, and one of our core missions, fundamental missions, is to help, uh, help out when we can. Uh, that's why we're proud to announce this particular initiative. It is a new centralized intake uh, hotline number for seniors and adults uh, with disabilities. And our slogan about this is that uh, for this population, one call does it all. Uh, by calling a single phone number, Cuyahoga County, County's seniors and adults uh, will be able to learn about how to access government benefits that they've earned, uh, income assistance, housing resources, or health care services. Uh, the number is 216-420-6700. It's 216 Zero, zero. And by calling that centralized intake hotline, you're also going to be uh, able to report uh, suspected instances of abuse. It's another uh, primary mission of the Department of Senior and Adult Services. So for seniors that are looking for help and assistance and trying to figure out what benefits they can access, this is the number to call. For individuals, whether they're seniors or, or family members or neighbors that suspect uh, abuse, they can call that number as well and we'll get right on it. Now at this point, um, to talk a little bit more about this program and how it's going to unfold, I want to recognize uh, and bring to the podium uh, Tracy Mason. She's uh, the administrator of our, of our Department of Senior and Adult Services. Tracy? We are proud to announce and launch our new intake line. One call does it all. The number is 216 420-6700. Senior and adults with disabilities can receive assistance and learn more about resources available to them. In 2013, our agency served nearly 25,000 clients by providing a broad range of services. In time like these, where the weather can be so unkind to those we serve, it is critical for our agency to think of ways to be efficient. Not too long ago, there were as many as four intake lines a client could call for services, oftentimes making it quite difficult for them to navigate through our programs. Other times, calls were going directly to staff voicemail messages. With the assistance of the County Treasurer's Office and Health and Human Services Department, extensive work was done to eliminate those barriers. By implementing a centralized intake system that provides one seamless entry point for clients to access our services like congregate meals, home delivered meals, transportation, as well as addressing concerns keeping our seniors safe. Also through the intake line, we will also link seniors to resources out in the community as well. This consolidated effort has allowed senior and adult services to use fewer staff hours for intake and staff can now focus on client center tasks and increase our ability to serve more seniors. By streamlining this process, we have increased training for our staff, standardized our process across all programs, eliminated excessive voicemail messages, and most importantly, Anyone who calls now will receive a live voice on the phone. We recognize that we can't do this work alone. 
and forming collaborative partnership is critical to our ability to meet the growing needs of seniors and adults with disabilities. As a representative of the agency that's responsible for planning, coordinating and administering state and federally funded services and programs for seniors in the five counties covered by our planning and service area, I am very pleased to stand here this morning as a partner with the Cuyahoga County Division of Senior and Adult Services as they launch their new centralized intake process. The new centralized intake initiative will simplify the process not only for our resource consultants and care managers when they call DSAS to make referrals for services, but all callers, whether they're professionals in the aging network who call this line to make a referral, or it's a single individual calling to seek services for themselves, will find that the process is much more efficient and calls will be handled much more properly and appropriately being directed to the most appropriate person to provide information and resources. It's often challenging to stay informed and up-to-date about services available in the community for seniors and families. The centralized intake will help to eliminate that challenge. In summary, the key to this new centralized intake process is accessibility. There has long been a need in the county for a central location for, for seniors and adults with disabilities and those working on their behalf to get access to services that are available through the county. This new process is dedicated to helping people from the moment they contact DSAS through the referral process and beyond. The Area Agency on Aging is committed to this process. We are pleased to support DSAS in this effort and congratulate them on making it a reality because one call truly does it all. Thank you for your time. And I'll turn it back to Executive Fitzgerald. Thank you. Um, I, I think that does it. I just want to thank Tracy, and not just Tracy and um, Sandy, but also um, everybody that works with Tracy. There's 180 or so folks who work in the Department of Senior and Adult Services. They work very hard, um, and, and they deserve our thanks and uh, respect. This was something that they've been working on for a while with their partners, uh, like Sandy. And uh, so this is an important day, not just as an achievement for them, but a, a way that where we can um, check another uh, box in terms of how we're going to help seniors. I know how much they um, care about this. If, 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 if for some reason this number ever goes down, we'll give out Tracy's cell phone number. <laughs> um, she'll be happy to, um, we'll put that on the website, text it out to everybody. Um, no, but they really care about this and, and uh, they've dedicated their lives to this and, um, and, and, and it's, it's really meaningful. And so I, we hope that in a small way, this is going to help our senior population.